Hi everybody and welcome back to Dinosaur in the Library. I'm Dawn and I really appreciate everybody coming back to hear me ramble. So this is Wednesday so that means this is Top 5 Wednesday and this week's Top 5 is the Top 5 series I'm looking forward to starting this year. Um, top 5 Wednesdays were started by Lainey over at Ginger Reads Lainey. I will link her below as well as the Goodreads group um, in which she lists the topics and where you can list your channel if you do these videos. So without further ado, I shall get started. The first series is uh, one that is, I'm sure, very familiar to you booktubers. And it is The Lunar Chronicles by Marissa Meyer. So if you've watched any of my videos, you know that I actually already read this, but I read it just after the first of the year. So I'm counting this as starting this year. And then on Friday, I was in the bookstore and picked up this nice shiny copy of Scarlet. And I'm very excited to get to read it. And then as soon as I finish it, I'm going to pick up Press. Um, so I am definitely getting those read this year, and I know Ferris is about to come out, and then the last one supposedly in the series comes out this year. So I'm definitely interested in getting these read so that I can read the last one when it comes out. So the second series, I technically already read the first one of this one as well, but I read it a few years ago. I don't remember very much about the story other than the fact that I really did enjoy it. And I think actually the fourth book in the series made it to my last week's top five books I'm most anticipating this year, but I'm counting it as starting because I'm going to have to start the series over, and that is the Fairyland series by Catherine M. Valente, and there are, as of some time this year, I don't know the exact release date yet, as of sometime this year, there are four books in this series plus at least one other short fiction, which is a prequel, I think, and there's supposed to be... I think according to Goodreads, there are two more coming out without, they do not have titles listed, uh, nor do they have um, publication dates. So I'm not really sure when that's going to happen. But I do really want to get that series caught up. Just in case she does decide to do more than six, that way I'm not woefully behind. Uh, the third series that I would like to read is the Johan Cabal series. Uh, the first book in that is the Yo is Johan Cabal, the Necromancer. And I swore I had this book, but I do not actually. So I cannot show it to you. Uh, I do love the cover and all the covers are similar. They're very beigey sort of brown with skeleton images. And I really enjoy the covers, but I really want to read the stories. They sound very interesting. And I think there are four and at least one short fiction. And I have never even picked these up. Um, other than maybe reading the back of it in a bookstore. So I'm really interested in checking these out. The fourth series, I actually do have the first one in, and that is the Lock and Key series by Joe Hill and Gabriel Rodriguez. I've had this probably since summer, and I didn't want to start it because I was afraid I was going to get too far behind, and I know really that's kind of counterproductive because if you don't start, you're going to get really far behind. But it worked in my favor because then I found out that the series was ending and I think there are six volumes. So as soon as I finish this one, I can get the others little by little and I don't have to worry about the fact that I'm falling behind even further. And I'm definitely going to read this this year. Um, I love Joe Hill. Anything that he touches is gold as far as I'm concerned. So I'm really looking forward to that one. And the final one is The Parasol Protectorate by Gail Carriger or Carriger. Not sure which. And the first book in that is Soulless. And I think all of the books have less in the title, like Heartless, Soulless. And I can't remember all the all the titles. But I definitely I've been wanting to read this for quite some time now. And I definitely want to get it read this year because I I heard I can't remember where that this year the first book in a new adult series by Gail Carriger in this universe called The Parasol Protectorate Abroad is due to come out. And I would like to catch up with this so that I can start reading that because I'm almost 100% that I am going to love this series. So yeah, that is my top five for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And this is probably the shortest video I have done as of yet. So there you go. But if you uh, like these videos and you like what I'm doing, go ahead and hit the subscribe button down there below. Leave me a comment, like with the video, send me a tweet, friend me on Goodreads, just essentially come find me. And if you do these top five Wednesday videos, please leave your, your information down below or just, you know, leave a message that says, hey, 
come check me out. And I will. I will come watch your videos. I'll subscribe. And maybe we can become book buddies. So I hope that everyone has a wonderful week and keep on reading. Bye.